Season's greetings. Chief Perry and I just want to acknowledge all the hard work and dedication of our Department of Military and Veterans Affairs family. That includes our Colorado National Guard, our Division of Veterans Affairs, and our Civil Air Patrol. Over 100 Colorado National Guardsmen are saving lives by assisting our state partner with COVID and Fire Guard missions. Many of our members are also working Homeland Defense missions through the holidays and they're sacrificing time away from their families to protect our nation from airborne space and missile threats. The traditions that we celebrate this special season help keep us strong emotionally and spiritually as we reflect upon the season of light and hope. The Chaplain Corps is so honored to walk with each of you and your families during this special season as we look with expectancy to the opportunities and challenges of 2022. Our Civil Air Patrol members are volunteering to conduct a record number of flights and emergency ground rescue missions. The last two years have been a really trying time for our force as we've responded to the COVID-19 pandemic while also responding to our state and federal missions. But through it all, you've been there, just standing in the gap to serve others. And for that, we want to say thank you. Our state and county veteran service officers, our cemetery workers, our Ross employees are working tirelessly through the holidays on behalf of our military members, the veterans and their families to ensure that they get the benefits that they are so entitled to. During the holiday season, it's especially important to stay connected to all members of your family. And as always, the DMVA family and people are first. This is our second year fighting COVID, and I know that these are challenging times, which you are serving our communities, our state, and our nation. Thank you for serving. I am so proud of the work that you are doing. To all our service members and their families in this holiday season, I want to encourage you to take the time in this special season to reflect on those more important things of life. Faith, family, friends, our communities, our service to our great state and nation. God bless you all and give you great joy in the new year. For those of you who are deployed overseas and the family members who are supporting them, I know that these are challenging times. I wish you the very best for the holiday season and know that you are in our thoughts. Happy holidays to you as well. So whatever your tradition is, if it's Christmas, Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, may your holiday be meaningful and for all. May this be a season of joy, of happiness, of light, and really, may we have peace on earth. Happy Holidays!